Thank you very much. Um, I would like to share and discuss with you two main ideas. The first idea is the integrated approach of agriculture and nutrition, but also embedded in a larger integrated approach together with health, education, and other um, uh, development sectors. Like we are um, exploring in the, in the Millennium Village project, which is setting up these delivery systems or active and developing these delivery systems for, uh, deli for uh, implementing an, an uh, integrated approach across different sectors. And um, our uh, team leader from the Koraro village in Ethiopia is also here and can further discuss this also with you about how to um, set up delivery systems for agriculture nutrition, but combined with uh, health education um, and infrastructure also. And this brings me also to uh, the next point that um, working together with all these different sectors in the Millennium Villages project, it um, challenges challenged us to create a common language across these sectors and this challenged us to set up a monitoring system across uh, sectors and to create new metrics that make sense as well as to agriculturalists as well as to uh, nutritionists and what a big question that we have is like how do we assess agriculture systems in a system approach for um, for nutrition and particularly nutritional diversity because often agriculture systems are o optimized for yield or cost value benefit or for delivering specific um, nutrients but how can we assess agriculture systems at different scales um, for the diversity of nutrients that is required by human diets and this at different levels of the f at which the food sheds operates I'm not able to show my slides here, but they will be posted online. And um, they show you an, a, a metric that um, addresses the nutritional diversity of systems and how this can change over time and how this is linked to some of the nutritional outcomes. Uh, thank you very much. <laughs>